Hello, hey everyone. So I've got a, uh, a new mic that I'm trying out today. I thought I would come back here and we could take a look at the compost together. I haven't checked this in quite a while. I just added all these leaves to it. We're gonna take a look. We'll take this little wall off and we'll flip this and we'll get a good look at what's going on in there. Cause we've been filling this compost up um, every, like once every, once a week maybe we have a little compost bucket inside that we'll bring out and we'll dump in there. And I really don't turn it very often. We try to just do the no rules compost and it seems to work pretty well. I also have this compost tumbler over here that I made. I featured this in videos before. I figured we'd take a look at what's going on inside there now. Look at that. Look at that guy there, that is rich. Ooh. So yeah, this is a mix of uh, grass clippings, sawdust, and leaves, and there were a lot of leaves, I tell you what, man. This has probably been in here for a good while now, like six months at least. It's starting to look really good, I think. It's a shame there's no worms in here. That's the only problem with these things. It's like you can introduce beneficial vermin, but, you know, you have to do that separate. And with a system like this, it's just right on the ground where the vermin already are. I'm gonna be making a video about earthworms because there's just so much information uh, to learn about these things. Earthworms can increase the fertilization of fields. That's why it's so important to build up your natural earthworm population wherever you are. Boy, these were not the shoes for this. It's kind of warm today, but it's, it's not good enough. I'm gonna open up the shop here and grab the pitchfork and we'll turn that uh, compost over and we'll see what we can find. It's all just compacted in. Now, I did flip this once whenever I added all the leaves to it, but other than that, I really haven't done anything to this. Let's try and do this one-handed. <sighs> That's not gonna work. Old sunflower stem. That's the good stuff, look at that. There it is right there. That's good compost. Look at that right there. That is good, good compost. Slimy yet satisfying. Not too bad, right? Put this back in place. So I have at least three seed boxes that I need to glue up and put together. Kind of just been putting that off because it's been really cold out here. And I've been trying to work out other stuff. I just got off the phone with uh, the manager of the local farmer's market. We're going to be trying to set up a stand this year. 
looked into the farmer's market, looked into uh, what's called the maker's market, which is a separate thing that we'll have to apply for in order to sell uh, wood stuff or candles or uh, anything that isn't directly grown. Just thought I'd get a few shots today of some compost. Um, working on some new videos. We just got something in the mail that is pretty incredible. I'm going to be making a video about that later. Stay tuned for a video about earthworms. Lily's going to be doing a video about seed starts soon. Shout out to Tress. Shout out to Darren. I can't be happier just to have all you guys following us and doing all that, paying attention. That's really cool. Thanks very much for watching today, guys. Hope y'all are always doing well. Not too bad of a day, honestly. I think that's gonna do it for me. Don't give up, keep growing, guys. See you next time. Goodness. Terrible, terrible choice in shoes. Absolutely awful. What a bad idea.